Welcome, my friends of the interwebs, and welcome to uh, um, uh, unboxing, an enveloping, a hopefully much, hopefully many more contributions to uh, the charity that uh, Stephen Hayes and myself are uh, putting on. Um, <clears throat> and by the way, I uh, just want to uh, bring notice that obviously, if you've watched the video, first place is going to get you uh, this uh, cookbook by uh, Stephen Hayes, plus a T-shirt by me. Um, he did want to make clear, though, that you can download this cookbook off of his website, uh, FruitWise, and uh, I'll put a link uh, in the info section to his website. Definitely worth checking out. Stephen Hayes is, uh, is, a, is an awesome, awesome, awesome guy. Anyway, all right, where to get started? You know what? I think I'm going to use uh, Jeff Cutlery Lover's uh, knife that he gave me to un, uh, un envelope, unbox these. Um, the first one is from the Soul Asylum. It seems a little big for a contribution, um, so it may not have anything to do with the charity drive, but uh, we'll go ahead and take a look-see. Um, I don't really even need that. We'll see what's going on here. Yeah, I don't believe that it is a uh, contribution. It is a Kershaw knife. There's a message in here. And you know what? <laughs> Reading glasses. All right, what's it say? It says, add this to the contest prizes. It is, a, it is new. I only opened it to sharpen it. Be careful. Uh, I ask nothing in return. Just wanted to add to the contest and show uh, some support. Uh, thanks and money love as always. You know what, dude? You are awesome. The Soul Asylum. I'll put a link to his channel. Totally unexpected and and definitely cool. Um, so this will be added to uh, the first place prize. So you get the cookbook, uh, the Kershaw knife, and um, looks like Kershaw makes some really good knives, by the way. Uh, and the uh, Botley Men's uh, cookbook, or excuse me, Botley Men's cookbook, the Kershaw knife, and uh, T-shirt for me. Big, big shout out to the Soul Asylum. Very cool, dude. All right, this one is, uh, I just wrote the, the town it's from. It's from Fayetteville because he didn't put the, uh, the YouTube username on the outside. Hopefully, he put it on the inside. And if he didn't, I don't know, this knife might not be exactly what needs to be used. <laughs> I don't know. I love a buck knife, but this might be a little overkill for these little envelopes. Okay, if he didn't, uh, oh, I, I believe there's a note here. Okay, it says, uh, Richard, great thing you're doing. Here's my $5 bill. A $5 bill. Awesome, 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 awesome. That brings us up to six bucks. And you know what? It seems to me, I know who this is. My, it, it, and you know what? I know a lot of bills. <laughs> I believe uh, it is Mr. 45 Bullet. Um, but I'll have to verify that. If that is the case, it will be. He will. Put, I will put his. Um, I will put his uh, username and all that uh, in the info section. You know, it seems to me he did send me a message telling me that he had forgot to put his uh, username on here. Ugh, I get so many messages every day, and you know I'm getting old. All, Alzheimer's starting to kick in. Anyway, uh, and if by the way, if this is Bill, it will not be long before I start making Bill's uh, voodoo doll. Uh, soon, very soon. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, this one here is from Knee Down for God. Uh, dude's name is Seth. He is my he is my personal pastor on YouTube. He has all kinds of cool. I can't even tell you if you are in. Oh, by the way, he's doing this thing called uh, Jesus Three Sixty. And basically, he's uh, reading scripture uh, every day for 365 days, um, which is a lot harder than it seems. And he and he has given us one dollar bill. Perfecto! Thank you, my friend Seth. You are the man. Um, if you are a religious person, if you're a Christian person, uh, check out uh, Knee Down for God. He's an awesome guy. I really like Seth a lot. Okay, Ironhead 41. Ironhead 41. Has thrown us a dollar towards the flood victims of Pakistan. Awesome, awesome, awesome. 
I'll keep the ones and five together. So so far so good. Seven bucks. Or excuse me, eight bucks. Ugh. All right, Propaganda Buster, Tony. Propaganda Buster, one of my all-time favorite uh, YouTubers, to say the least. Tony is a cool, cool dude. He's famous in Japan. They wrote a book about him. Or, of course, he will tell you that he wrote the book. They just published it. <laughs> you know? Tony is one of the coolest dudes I've ever met in my life. He's a really cool dude. They call him Texas Daddy in, uh, in Japan. And when I say he's big in Japan, I mean he's big in Japan. Holy... You know, you must be giving me some of that royalty money here for the for the donation. A $20 bill. He's a very generous man. A very generous man. Hello, Man Bad Voodoo. Great going uh, to help these uh, in need, or those in need. Count me in to help the victims of uh, those floods. God bless you, sir. Sincerely, Tony, a.k.a. Propaganda Buster. Um, and I also had the AKA uh, Texas Daddy. <laughs> I don't think he likes the name Texas Daddy. The Japanese picked that for him. Um, I think it's kind of a cool name though, Texas Daddy. <laughs> Tony, you are a hell of a guy. I'll always say that about you. By the way, Tony, just so you know, um, got your shirt out today. Uh, it took me a while. I got a little sidetracked, but your shirt went out today and looking for me, Marble shirt went out today. Both you guys. And um, yeah, so. All right, uh, this, now this one here is interesting. I put Dayton on both these. Both of these envelopes are from the same guy, okay? I'm not sure who until open. Hopefully he's got his username inside. Uh, this one here he forgot to uh, lick, and uh, it showed up, unfortunately. <laughs> it showed up. <laughs> That's how it showed up, yeah. Sorry about that, brother. You know, it happens. But um, anyway... Uh, I think maybe he realized maybe he realized this situation because he this is exactly the same guy, so we'll find out here. Okay. All right. Well, this is a check for five dollars. Um, five five dollars is that zoom is that zooming in there we go five dollars i'm gonna look there because it's got his address and whatnot on it um all right richard here's five dollars for the pakistan flood relief fund and it's gary um but no username got shit falling all over the place uh you know what he may he may have been another one of those that wrote me and told me hey i'm sending you something whatever I guess I wish you guys understood how many PMs I get every day, and sometimes it just kind of floods in, and it just kind of gets all. To, I don't know. Gary, send me, um, send me your username. Just tell me again if you did before. I'm sorry about that. Also, let me know if you had anything in this, or if you just. I'm not sure what the deal is with that. Um, okay, so we're doing okay, people. We're doing okay. We'll let Hocus Pocus. Uh, we'll let him uh, do uh, the accounting. <laughs> you can keep track of it all. Um, awesome, 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 awesome. We are on our way. Uh, like I said, my goal is $1,000. Uh, this contest uh, ends, this charity drive contest ends October 10th. Hopefully we start building some steam. We'll, we'll leave this in a pile here. Hopefully they start reproducing. Um, real quick note about my shirts. You know, I, I've been getting a ton and I don't even know if the word ton describes it, but a a shit ton of requests for people to buy my shirts. And, you know, I feel you, people. I really do. I, I, I feel you. Um, kind of, you know, you're kind of making me feel bad about this thing because I, <laughs> I don't want to sell shirts. Um, I really don't. Uh, hopefully you can win one in this contest. Uh, I'll probably have more contests in the future. Um, I mean, I... I you guys are making it rough on me, man. I told you from the beginning I didn't want to sell t-shirts. Um, maybe I'll change my mind about that, but, you know, right now I just am not down with it. I've just seen too much headache when I look at Guar, Guar trying to sell his t-shirts and I was just everybody else. It's a pain in the ass. Um, but I appreciate the interest. I think that's awesome that you would be interested in a t-shirt for me. I mean, I really, that is awesome. It makes me feel really great to think that somebody would really would would want to spend their own money to have a t-shirt for me i dude that makes me feel awesome but please from for, for now on just 
just for now. Let's see. Maybe I'll change my mind in the future. Let me get through this contest.